This module evolved through the experiences, mostly bad, of surveyors attempting to relocate stations that had been surveyed by crews in earlier years. Anyone who has ever attempted to do this will soon acknowledge the importance of this module. We describe a number of techniques that can be used that collectively should increase the probability that crews will be able to relocate a site that you have sampled. We recommend using as many of these procedures as possible. Take photographs and get GPS coordinates if you can and use station markers to document the upper and lower boundaries of your site. What crews have to watch out for is the use of terms that can be misinterpreted, such as right or left. Rather, we suggest they use terms like north and south, which cannot be misinterpreted. We also recommend that crews take the time to document the local features that might be influencing the stream conditions by filling out the site features form. This form guides users in their detective work as they look for specific indicators of habitat conditions, such as watercress, which is an indicator of groundwater, barriers to fish migration, adjacent land uses that could contribute to unstable banks or poor riparian vegetation. They should also look out for materials that might influence the burrowing depth of fish, such as hard pan clay or bedrock. It is also in this section that we document the riparian vegetation communities.